it's the next day already and I've tested my float and I filled it with the hose and I used quite a bit of water I'm gonna guess maybe I don't know 75 gallons I think each one of these uh, between the bars is about a hundred gallons so about 75 gallons to fill 90 feet that's a little less than 90 feet actually now it's time to dig a hole and join the pipe together so I can fully automate the system off of my water collection system. I don't plan on growing out here in the winter so I'm not burying this thing very deep. I got a lot of rock and clay and, and it just killed me to dig all that. So, And if I do decide uh, to do this in the winter time, my upright pipes would freeze anyway so I had I would have to add heat tape to them and so there's no reason why I can't run the heat tape underground and just cover this whole area. I'm going to leak check this. I'm going to turn on the main valve. I teed it off with no valve on this guy because I do already have a main valve. So here goes nothing. It's filling. You can hear it gurgling. Nothing's leaking, everything's fine, so I'll bury the pipe now. I do have a concern about heavy rain pushing down on the float, so I'll have to make a little cover for this. And I can't tell if it's sticking up above. No, it's not. Okay, so great. What I can do, uh, this may be an idea for other folks too, is I can take the end that I cut off that's slightly larger and I can cut it with a jigsaw and form a little cap that'll pop over the top and it'll protect that from heavy rain or hail or whatever that might hit it and turn it on and add water I don't need. Hey, she's all covered up and in the future I'm going to, that's a uh, a water pipe that hasn't been connected but it runs under my driveway I put it in before the driveway so I've got a, a stub out over there by that cone and I'm gonna rent a trencher and trench over to the tank I'm gonna put in one of these cool floats that I have in the rain gutter system in the in the water barrel and that way uh, if it does not rain it'll never go below that point it'll fill with city water not that I like that idea but you know it'll keep my my uh, bed from going dry. Okay, I'm getting the ingredients for Larry's garden mix, his uh, planting mix. They didn't have, they had everything but the dolomite and I'm on my way to get my uh, horse manure. I haven't seen it yet. Hopefully it's compo composted a little bit. We'll see when I get there. Going for the horse manure. Hope it's old stuff. I don't know what good horse poop looks like, but this stuff's pretty moist and it looks like it's well composted, composted. And I got probably what I need, but I can always come back for more. I certainly didn't get enough of peat moss and that sort of thing. I didn't want to overbuy. So I'll see how far that gets me. I've no Thanks for the contribution to my garden. Yeah, thank you. What I've done is cut a cover that is a little bit farther than halfway. So it's, it should snap into place here. I'll push it over the pipe. Come on, yeah, see, it snapped into place. And now I can slide slide that open to have access so good there it is now it's covered get covered hole I've just used the 2 and 7 8 inch bit to drill out this bucket here it's a lot less holes bigger holes um, it leaves larger burrs but I think that's the route I'm gonna go originally I was drilling smaller holes in them 
and it's just too much work and I think I get better aeration with the larger holes anyway so that's that's the route I'm gonna go and the plugs the little plastic plugs fall right out of the bit they don't even stick in there so this is the best way to go I think it'll get through it faster well my time is very limited uh, I'll be leaving in a week or so and not even a week less than a week so I've got to get this done I'm gonna be drilling holes all night I think so I'll end this video here the next video will be uh, composting I think not composting but making Larry Hall's soil and getting that all together and packing the buckets if my replacement bags come in soon hopefully tomorrow so please subscribe if you like this video and if you want to see future episodes and the progress here uh, you'll have to hit that subscribe button in just a second so thanks a lot for watching this one and hopefully uh, you'll stick around and, and check out the uh, the ending of this Thanks. Bye.